Okay guys, another trending seems to be Chrysler 200 issue. This one's only got 15,000 miles on it, approximately. Uh, Basically, they brought it in, said it was overheating, and uh, so I popped the hood. Sure enough, the coolant level's low, and I'll show you the reservoir out there. But anyway, uh, knowing that it was probably another bad radiator fan, like I'd seen before, we go over here to climb it, hit climb it on and max AC. That'll command the air conditioning on full, and the fan should spin. What I found out was, the fan wasn't spinning and of course it's not going to run now because I've got it unplugged but I unplugged it to check for an open circuit in the motor there and when I tested it the circuit was open so that told me right away that the fan motor was bad like I've been seeing here many times but when I first started seeing these it was kind of tricky at first to diagnose because I'd see a bunch of coolant residue underneath the reservoir there and later found out that when these engines were overheating at idle like this, it was boiling out the top and running down the fender with uh, the splash shield there. And that's what made me think it was initially a leak. But after I tried to turn the air conditioning on and it wouldn't cool, I saw the fan didn't move. I knew right away that it was a problem with the fan or the fuse or something there. So I'll demonstrate the uh, getting the DB lime out and checking for an opening of the motor. What I can do, with one hand here is take my test light, go down to the positive voltage here side of the motor, and as you can see, the test light lights up. So that means I'm getting power to this connector here and to the motor, but the motor doesn't spin. So we know we got a bad cooling fan. This is like the third or fourth one I've done so far within the last few months, so. Looks like this has turned out to be another common issue on these things. Seems like once we get one thing fixed, another one comes up. First was the trannies and the thermostats. And now these cooling fans. At least, that's what I've been seeing a lot of. I'm sure other people are seeing other things. But anyways, I'm going to get a fan ordered here and put another one in. Hopefully that will take care of the problem.